Yo, what up is Don? Sammy Lee here. We are the Soul Brothers, and we are back up inside the YouTube. All right, we're back with a, did I already expose the shoe? I mean, yeah, they can read did. the title anyway. <laughs> exactly. Right? Yeah. Well, we're trying to hide the shoe for a second. You can't <laughs> see it yet. Don't show them. Oh, sorry. You can probably still see it right now. We can't see what's on the screen. Yeah. Anyways, does it basketball? Does it basketball? We're back. Back up at it with the, the series. The NBC's new hit series, Does It Basketball. Yep. And we're doing the Chuck Taylor 2s. Man, this is crazy. This is crazy. This is the original, original basketball shoe. And, Redone. Uh, yeah, people used to play in this, but uh, it, it used to be a lot worse, you know? Yeah. So the new thing about this is it has a lunar line insert. But um, yeah, let's, let, let's just, uh, throughout this video, we're going to answer the question, Does It Basketball? And let's start off with the traction. So what do we call this traction? This is uh, Chuck traction. Chuck traction, okay. Yeah. That's like squares and like- Diamonds. A, or diamonds and I don't know what the, uh, yeah. But um, it surprisingly, it was actually really nice. Um, I don't know how this works. It doesn't look like it'll be nice, but it's nice. It's uh, pretty, actually really squeaky. It's a nice sticky, like, gum bottom, Yeah, you know? I think it has to do with the um, rubber content. Yeah, it's, like, gum is, like, the classic outsole yeah. rubber, you know? Yeah. So, yeah, you stop uh, pretty hard and pretty fast. Um, it's a lot better than a lot of shoes that I've tested for this series. I think it's, like, the best one that there has been in the, for this series, right? Which isn't saying much. Which is not saying much, but, um, yeah. But um, it was actually really nice. I give it maybe like a eight, seven or eight. It was, it was that good, you know. Yeah. So traction was on point. You can't go wrong. Um, and you really, I really didn't have to wipe on uh, that much. So um, it was a good traction. Nice. Yep. So what do we got in the midsole here? The midsole. Uh, let me take out the insole for you guys, just to show you how crappy it is. <laughs> so it's Lunar Lawn, and you know Nike's cushion, you know, and you want to see how thin it is in the forefoot, that's how thin it is. So in the forefoot you don't get crap, but in the heel it feels pretty nice, it's not super thick, you know, mm -hmm. um, not as thick as maybe in the interest in the Kobe 9s and the Kobe series, you know, but um, uh, it's not that nice. You know, um, you weren't feeling it. I, I wasn't feeling it, especially yeah. in the forefoot. It hurt really bad, actually, right. when I was uh, running really hard and really fast and uh, jumping around in him. Uh, my the the ball of my feet was hurting and uh, it just felt a lot of pain. Whatever it is, it's light years better than uh, the Chuck One, probably, right? And light years better than the Vans, though. Yeah, <laughs> I mean those two cushions were rough. They're really bad, yeah. But um, so, yeah, the heel is nice, it's not bad, but the forefoot is just what uh, killed me. And um, this, uh, under that is this hard ass rubber. So um, it wasn't the nicest cushion, but if you want uh, to feel really low to the ground and you want a really responsive cushion, then this is the shoe to go. But I was not feeling it. My feet hurt because the cushion was way too thin in the forefoot, you know? Really? So I give it like a four or five. Mm. That's how bad it was. It was way too stiff. Four or five. All yep. Right. Moving on. Moving on to the upper. The upper is a, um, what is this? Just canvas again? Yeah. It's just canvas. But it's thicker and a little softer now. Yeah. Uh, uh, compared to the, blush. yeah, compared to the um, Vans also. Yeah. And um, there's this rubber right here in the toe area. <laughs> and uh, it was, it was nice. Uh, it felt nice on the foot. Uh, it wasn't the best, I guess, but um, it was, it wasn't. It wasn't bad. Yeah. You know, I don't. I don't really know how to rate this canvas. You know, yeah. it's kind of weird. You know, but um, yeah. So moving on to fit. The fit. Well, it's a woven textile upper. Uh, yeah, that's what it's. It's. It's the chuck knit. The chuck yeah, it's knit. Chuck you know? knit. This is chuck <laughs> knit. The original knit. Yeah, exactly. Everything's really knit if it's a textile. Yeah, basically. So um, yeah, it wasn't bad. So now moving on to fit. Fit. Uh, it fits really um pretty long actually. So you have to go half a size down. And if it's super freaking narrow, even for my narrow foot, um, it was still a little tight. So um, make, just just be careful of that. But um, the fit was actually uh, pretty nice. And then also right here in the ankle uh, ankle area, the fit, um, it's really hard to get it, uh, get your foot into the shoe. 
you yeah. know so it's it, it's it, it took me a good five minutes to put this on. <laughs> that's how annoying it is you know just because it's a high top maybe i should have gotten the lows but mm -hmm. you know i needed the um the ankle support so yeah. which uh, is amazing right yeah it's, it's actually not that bad um <laughs> i couldn't really fit my ankle brace in because it was too hard to put, even right. put my foot in it but um it wasn't too bad you know it wasn't the best actually it's actually not that good but um ankle support was all right how's ventilation Mm, uh, I don't remember my foot getting too hot in these actually. Yeah. So it wasn't that bad. Right. Uh huh. And then support, uh, ankle support wasn't bad. Uh, what else is there? Lockdown. Lockdown was good too. Um, it wasn't bad actually. I just don't know how to freaking describe this shoe because, um, isn't it isn't it kind of crazy where like it, it, even if it, you don't really need a basketball specific shoe to play basketball in sometimes. No. You know, you, like, you can really play in any shoe, really. Yeah, you if can. It's okay, but um, the more you play, though, the sooner you should get out of a bullshit shoe. Yeah, you know. It's pretty much it. Yeah, exactly. You know, but so. you can really play <clears throat> basketball in any shoe. It's just like. I, I mean, people, to, this was a, a standard, you exactly. know, in basketball. This yeah. was it, you know? Yeah. And a few other shoes. I mean, you know, a big shoe ba company back then was also Pony, and, you know, they didn't have much tech at all. Yeah. But, uh, so this was an, a an athletic shoe, but you know, we don't live in those, those times anymore. And if, yeah. if you can choose not to, you know, you probably just don't. Yeah. You so know? It, it's kind of, it's kind of difficult to describe, you know? Yeah. Aesthetically though, these are straight clean. Yeah. I like how these you look. You know, Chucks are just classic. Yeah, you, you can't even hate on Chucks yeah. at all. But they're not comfortable. <laughs> no. They're, they're not, not comfortable. for comfort anymore. Yeah. You know? And, um... So moving on to uh, what the durability, I think these would be pretty freaking durable, right? Shocks are pretty durable. Yeah. I mean, this upper will besides, start to wear. Yeah, besides that, but after the, a little bit, but the rubber is pretty hard. Um, right here in the toe area where you do toe drags and whatnot is um, guarded by this rubber. So I think the only place that's weak would be the canvas, is the upper. So yeah, yeah, the durability I don't think would be bad. Price. Price was I think this is like eighty bucks. Oh, they upped it. Yeah, so it's kind of expensive. You can get the Chuck ones for like what fifty bucks. Yeah, Lunar Lawn uh, is not worth it. It's not that comfortable. Yeah. But um yeah so overall um you it this is the very first basketball shoe that does basketball. Is this is this the first one? I think it is. Yeah, it's, it's the first advanced. real shoe that really will basketball. Yeah, and you know traction isn't bad. The cushion is bad, but um. Uh, you can it works you know yeah and then the fit and everything wasn't bad at, at all either so um, i actually played a good um you know a lot in, in the shoe and my feet uh hurt and mm. i don't like the series you know <laughs> but, um, we're gonna die out here. we're gonna die i'm gonna kill you my know. feet you know what i'm saying but um yeah <laughs> uh, it, it does basketball it doesn't basketball very well but it does basketball and if you're not into basketball or you're not serious uh, about playing basketball and you just have converse i think it'll work yeah like if you're in the at the squat rack you know hitting a couple <laughs> sets and you want to come into the game real quick and get your ankles broke if you're then you can just come in with these <laughs> you know i'll be wearing my jordan 30s dude okay please don't be a gym bro don't mm -hmm. be one of those big ass guys uh that works out if you're buff and you're a football guy or whatever and you come to play basketball and you follow the shit out of everyone it's good. Come play. Come play. It's for fun, sure. You know? But break like, angles, just, you know? just tone it down tone a little. It, just know. take it down a few notches. Take it easy. Take it easy. Everything's going to be all right. <laughs> okay. We're going to have a little cardio. We're going to shoot some baskets. Yeah. We're going to have some fun. No one's going to tackle in each other. There's not going to be any fist fights. All right. Um, it is okay. It, it's everything gonna be fine. is going to be okay. It's going to be fine. <laughs> um, yeah. But, you know, there it is. This, this is a. Uh, first of the series to actually basketball yep the converse chuck taylor 2 an instant classic an instant classic yep this is a classic mm -hmm. so that's it uh make sure to check us out on our social media like subscribe and share if you feel like it we would appreciate it yep and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow my name is don same here we are the soul brothers later peace